Hi Legends, in today's episode, I'll share with you exactly why I'm not buying Bitcoin yet. We've had this nice little pump here to the upside, but there's a specific level that we first need to hit before I will consider adding to my spot bags. Also, I took a nice trade here on Bluffin, the copy trading account, and I actually entered a short. Here you can see on the Bluffin copy trading account, I entered a short right over here, swing failure pattern from the local high. I will explain exactly why I entered the short here on the copy trading account on Bluffin. And remember, if you'd like to come and trade with me on Bluffin and follow my trades from a copy trading perspective, 80k bonus, first link under exchanges down in the description. All you need is an email, your cell phone number and a password and you can start trading in a couple of minutes. So watch the video until the end to not miss out on any alpha that I'm about to share. Let's go and analyze the price of Bitcoin. Right, legends, looking at the price of Bitcoin, I'm here on the small time frame, five minute time frame on Bitcoin. And the reason I entered the short over here, okay, and I will go into the higher time frames to explain it more clearly, is that we are here at a daily level. OK, and we've been chopping, chopping, chopping through this daily level. And then when we made upwards momentum here to the upside, I spotted some local bearish CVD. And then as we rejected, OK, we got the movement here to the upside that looked extremely bullish. And then as we rejected, I entered with my stop below the high. And now I'm waiting for lower prices according to my trading plan, where I'll plan to take some profits off the table. Right, legends. So here you can see, even with this massive bullish momentum here from Bitcoin, there are still short opportunities along the way. So I can be a bull and a bear during the same day from a day trading perspective. But it's not to say that we're just going to fall down from here, legends. This is not what I'm saying at the moment. As I'm saying, this small little scalp opportunities where I've lost the trend. We were at a critical daily level. So if we do get some upwards momentum here, legends, I want to see how price is going to react here at the 50% FIB level, taking it from the high to the recent low that we've made over here for potential another rejection to the downside or even as the 618 and the 786. The reason I am not convinced to add Bitcoin to my spot packs just as yet, let's zoom out onto the larger time frames. Right, legends, looking at Bitcoin here on the four hour time frame, there's a couple of bullish signs, okay? We have acceptance back inside this range, okay? Currently in trading, back inside the range. So the probabilities do increase. When you have a deviation, you go to the bottom. Another deviation, you go to the top. OK, as soon as you get acceptance back inside the range, that usually increase probabilities that you're most likely going to come and tap the top of the range again at $70,000. So for now, uh, we have a tick. We have acceptance back inside the range. We have also broken this down sloping trend. OK, so potential retracements are maybe buying opportunities. But what I would like to see is when I zoom into this price action over here, legends, when I take a FIP, from the highs to the lows, like I've said during many of my live streams, is that we have now tapped the 0 0.88, okay? This does increase that we have a possibility to come and claim this high. But I would like to see us claim this high at $63,846 before I will consider adding to my spot bags. Because we could definitely reject here by the 0 0.88 where this momentum or this structure over here can be an A, B, C here to the upside, right? To continue momentum here to the downside. It could also be an A, B, C here to the downside. Whichever corrective structure you are keeping an eye on from an Elliott Wave perspective is to say that only once we've claimed this high over here at $63,846, will I say, okay, well, now we We've invalidated most of the bearish scenarios okay and once we claim this high I will say okay now it's game on and any retracement is potentially a great buying opportunity and I want to buy during this retracement hopefully we will get the retracement because we could also smash through here retest these highs as support and continue the momentum here to the upside where we'll look at this corrective structure for potential buying opportunity but what I'm trying to get at over here legends is that we are not out the woods just as yet okay we have not claimed the high and this looks very bullish at the moment okay we have acceptance back inside the range we broke the diagonal trend we got acceptance back of back inside this massive diagonal trend on the daily time frame so for now things look bullish okay but i would like for us to claim this high i would rather be late to the party and have a more confirmed entry for a long possibility than just speculating that price is going to do this okay we are still inside of danger zone 
The other scenario that I'm watching over here, Legends, is that it often happens when you tap the 0.88, okay, price will retrace up until the 0.618 in confluence with the diagonal trend and this trend that's running here, tracking the momentum here to the upside and then attempt to claim the highs. And that could potentially be a nice bullish sign here for the price of Bitcoin. Right, Legends, there are also many alts that I'm currently keeping an eye on. I'm looking at AVAX. Okay, you can see breaking a down sloping diagonal trend from the mid March that's now been broken. I'm looking at Dogecoin, I'm looking at DOT, I'm looking at Veracity, I'm looking at XRP that I've spoken about during one of my previous live streams, Matic, and the list goes on. And I will discuss all of these altcoins in detail during my next live stream today. So make sure that you tune in. I hope you've enjoyed this update today, Legends. This trade that I took here on the Copy Trading Bluffin account, I also spoke about here inside our Legends Discord community. First link down in the description to come and join. Here you can see I gave a long video update where I analyzed the price of Bitcoin. We spoke about this potential shorting opportunity and, and I also went through a couple of the altcoins where I see potential buying opportunities and what I would like to see for bullish momentum to continue to the upside. Here you can also see I told the Legends I'm entering a short from the local high i'm spotting some local berry cvd and also highlighted the profit taking areas that i'm considering here to the downside so make sure to join our legends community first link down in the description and until the next one legends just for now